Hi, my wonderful people. I am so excited to come your way again with another video. Thank you so much for always co coming by to watch my video. You are all aware that uh, UEFA Champions League tournament is on and there is for both male and uh, female, men and women. But I'm talking on this video about the uh, UEFA Women's Champions League between Hackpin and the uh, Arsenal women. And it ended in 1-0 loss to Arsenal women. But before I go into details about it, I'd like to say thank you for your time. Thank you for coming. I appreciate it greatly. If you are here for the first time, consider subscribing to the channel, press the notification bell, so that you don't miss out in my subsequent videos. Okay? And also help and share the video if it is possible for you to do. I will appreciate it greatly. To all my friends out there, I want to say thank you. My subscribers, the new and the returning one, you are the best. I appreciate your support and your love. I do not take it for granted at all. Having said that, let's go straight into the gist. UEFA Women's Champions League, Akin 1, Arsenal Women 0. Arsenal were left frustrated as they failed to defeat against BK Akin in the first leg of their Women's Champions League qualifying second round clash. And Ayega's ball over the top was passed on by Tabita Tindel, who finished with composure past a wee goalkeeper, Manuel Simbaga, in the 77th minute of the match. Clarissa Larisse had a similar opportunity earlier in the contest when she went ran Simbaga, went through on goal but could only find the sanity. That could have been a sign and warning for Arsenal, but they did not take it. Alessia Russo was one of several Arsenal players unable to confer key chances as they came up short. They had all the chances, but they couldn't confer. Alessia Russo's looping header from Bert Mears cross was easily caught by Jennifer Falk. Another chance was wasted when she received the ball with her back to go and fire a low shot wide. Substitute Frida Manum was denied twice in the closing stages. She fired a low effort at goal from range, but dive but Falk dive to her left and permit ran the post. Frida Manas Eda then rattled against the <laughs> rattled against the crossbar, with the gunners failing to make the most of their opportunities. Despite controlling the game, surprisingly, with 67.9% possession, yet they lost the match. This is very, very disappointing and very frustrating to Arsenal. Anyway, they can redeem themselves in the second leg that we, we play here in UK, Middle Park Stadium. So the second leg of the tie will take place at Middle Park on Thursday, the 26th of September, which is just next week. Hope they will be able to right all the wrongs and be clinical in front of goals. Honestly speaking, they had all the chances for them to win the match, but it was never the case. That's football for you guys. I'd like you to make your comment on this performance by the Arsenal women. Very, very unexpected, very, very disappointing. But they are still in the game anyway, because the second line leg is yet to be played. And until the last whistle is blown, they are still 
in the game. What do you think Asna should do, Asna women, as it gets ready for Aki from Sweden? But before then, this weekend, they have a game against Manchester City women in the Women's Super League. That will be another crucial one. It's going to be the opening of the Women's Super League in Britain. They need to negotiate these two matches properly. I want you to have your comment made in the section, comment section. What do you think about it? What should the ref, I mean, the coach do to rectify the wrongs of today? They need to be clinical in front of goals. A lot of chances were missed. They want to walk the ball into the net. When they needed to shoot, they did not shoot. They control it, but possession is not does not result into victory. You must put the ball in the, to the inside the net for you to win again. I think they must learn their lessons. They must have learned their lessons. Thank you, guys. Appreciate your time and your presence. Take care of yourself till I come your way next time with another video. I like to say to you guys, bye bye for now. Thank you.